Hey guys, what's going on? Stormrider36 here, and today we are back with more Terraria. And today I am thinking my major, major thing is to maybe try and get a grappling hook. Now, for those of you who do not know, grappling hooks are literally what you would think from Batman or anything like that. Literally grappling hooks. They attach to a wall and they... You know, pretty much give me my double jump back. You know, this, the bliss, what the blizzard in the bottle gives me. And I would really enjoy having that. Because that would make my life about 20 times easier. Not only in caves and stuff, but, you know, just in everything. And, you know, we have this weapon now, which is amazing comparatively to the, our other weapons. So, you know, we're, we're rocking out with our, uh, whatever this thing's called, Blood Butcherer. So, you know, we got that from defeating the Eye of Cthulhu because we got Crimson Ore. And I know that I have to beat the Brain of Cthulhu to uh, make the Crimson Armor, which is a whole different level of armor than just the lead I have. And I'm going to keep the lead I have just for now, just because, you know, it, it worked for what happened. And we got a new NPC as soon as I left the house. Get out of here, Vulture. Get out of here. But, you know, Tomatoes, Tomatoes were just moving on up not to the east side though this is the west side of the world so i know somebody was thinking that like me and as you can see we now one shot the little slimes because this weapon is amazing but we are actually looking for something very specific and that's i think we've already found it if i remember this world correctly because there's i have multiple worlds so it's hard to remember i am look yep here it is right here the jungle this is exactly what I wanted, the jungle. Because the jungle, the uh, underground jungle has some of the best loot in the game. So that is where I want to go. And I've never, I haven't been down here yet because of the fact that, no, I still don't have a weapon that does light for me. I should probably get, oh, hi. I should probably get on that soon. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Alright, so we're just going to dig down until we find something, and I'll probably cut out until I get there, because it's boring to watch me do this. Alright, so it appears we have found ourselves a little hole somewhere. Throw that down there, see what's going on. Alright, let's go. Okay, so this is going to be a little bit difficult finding my way around here. Just because of the fact that I don't have a light pet yet. Oh wait, there's a thing over there. Ow, shit, shit. <laughs> ow, 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 Okay, so we're gonna throw that down there. But anyway, so, back to what I was gonna say. Uh, so we actually, like I never really realized this, but we've been actually finding cool things. Like, we found, like that's a keg that I can put in my house. Like, that's pretty cool to me. And now, oh, yes, okay, so these shoes right here. Oh, sh. Okay, we don't need the flippers. But these shoes right here, the ones that I just got, are very good because if I remember what shoes they are, it allows me to, like, yeah, slide down wall. See, look at that. So now, instead of just falling to my death, I can actually grab onto walls and, you know, not fall to my death. So, to me, that's a pretty good thing, because I like to fall to my death a lot. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but that's a thing I do quite frequently. So, no longer shall I do that, or at least to my own volition. I'll probably do it still, because I suck, but... Everything dies. No, everything dies. Oh, wait, oh, and then over here we have some piranha, which are actually very good for me to find. Oh shit. I accidentally released the hornets. Hornets bad. Okay, so I'm gonna kill these piranha because the piranha have a chance to drop something called a hook. And the hook is the thing I need to make a grappling hook because I can make chain out of uh, different metals, but grappling hook, I need to get off of a monster when I kill it. So yeah. That's how that goes. 
But that appears to be all that is. The jung underground jungle is very difficult because of the fact that... Is that a strange plant? Oh, but it's a sky blue flower, and I hope that doesn't die. But anyway, like I'm, I'm gonna keep going on explaining. It's very hard to find an open area of the underground jungle just because of really what it is. It's it's just an it's like a maze. It's worse than you know every other underground area because it's you know viney. There's a bunch of monsters that spawn down here. This and that reason, you know, you know what I'm talking about. It's just a lot harder to find an open area down here. But, I'm gonna try. We found one chest, and actually, I think this might be another open-ish area. Oh. Uh, this is pretty open. Let's see what we got going on. Okay. Okay, okay, I can deal with this. Yeah, this is open. Nice. Alright, let's keep going. Unfortunately, I still do... Oh, I say that and then it ends, but unfortunately, I still do not have any sort of light when I go mining, which is awful because... Oh, pfft. well, speak of the devil, I dug right down and do a thing. That's that's a worm. Fuck you, bitch. Okay, let's throw down a thing. There's a chest. I got a little worried. I didn't, start, I didn't see it. A flare gun. A fucking flare gun. And the reason I'm taking these uh, chests is going to become very apparent later uh, when I get farther along in this game. Because this game takes a very long time to get far along in. Dan Dan danger. What? Allows you to see nearby danger sources. Oh. Hm, that's a weird potion. But I'll take it nonetheless. See, if we didn't have climbing boots, we would have fell right there. Pull this out again. Right, we gotta go up. <sighs> Wait, I watch. Hiya, hiya. Oh fuck! Ow! Stop it! Ugh. All right, back to digging. But like I said before, it is a very- wait, that's a health potion. It's a very, you know, touch and go kind of basis. Ooh, silver ore, I'll take that. You know what I mean, with the uh, underground jungle. So, you know, that's the only- that's my only issue with the underground jungle, otherwise it's an amazing place to go f to find gear. And I don't really feel like digging through water, so I'm gonna go ahead and dig up out of a water source and then dig straight over here. Because whenever you're digging, try to avoid lava source or water sources unless you're digging to hell. Which we will be doing sooner or later. I don't know when exactly though. And I'm not particularly looking forward to that day. The underground jungle has to be one of my favorite areas, just in general, just because it's so beautiful. Like, look at, like, there's trees growing down here. Like, in no other game ever have I gone into an underground area and had trees growing. Like, it's just, it's beautiful down here. It's just so dangerous that I hate being down here because I think I'm gonna die every two seconds. But we found ourselves another semi-decent open cave now, and then now I'm just opening up hell on myself. That's always fun. Oh, well, I was mistaken. There's ore up there, though. So we're probably gonna throw that bad boy down. And dig up to that ore so that I can get it. Because it's still early game, and I would like to get, like, platinum armor, maybe. Or meteorite armor, you know. But we haven't had a meteorite come yet. Maybe we have, and I just missed it because it's, it's just a text notification you're not actually gonna know. 
just gonna be, you know, out of nowhere. Hey, guess what? Meteor comes, or, you know, you miss it like I may have, and then you find it one day, just out in the middle of nowhere. So we'll have to see where that goes. But anyway, back to digging. Oh wow, look what we dug right into. A fucking treasure chest room. Ooh, and we found a band of regeneration. Ooh, with 4% worth damage? Ooh, 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 ooh. I guess for now we don't actually need ice skates equipped because, you know, ice skates aren't important until you get a certain item. I'm not going to say what it is yet because, well, it's because I need a goblin army. That's like when this game starts to really pick up for me anyway. Is that goblin army spawns in because then you get the goblin tinkerer and a lot of people probably don't think too much about someone called the goblin tinkerer. I got a jet. Wait, a bazaar? Oh, immunity to pull. Hold on. We're putting that on while we're in here. Okay, while we're down here, we're putting on the bazaar because then I can't be poisoned. That's fucking cool. I'm okay with that. And there's a lot of items like that that uh, negate a certain debuff. And those are always amazing to have, but, you know, hard to find at the same time. But, you know, we'll find them all one day, and then we'll make... Because you, you guys haven't even seen the part of this game where you can combine items to make better items. Like, that's where this game starts to get really interesting, is when you can actually start combining, like, the Hermes boots and uh, the ice skates to make a different type of boots. Shit. Go away. But we're not at that point yet, so there's no point talking about it right now. Oh, more platinum. Cool, 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 cool. So, how you guys been doing? You guys been doing all right? Thank you for all the support on the channel recently. Thank you for people who've been watching this Terraria series. It's not going anywhere because this game is brand new to me, so it's like, it's not like Minecraft where I kind of needed that motivation from you guys. It's where I already have the motivation, so it's like, I'm, I'm going with it. And I love this series. A few of you guys, uh, a few of my friends seem to like it just because of the fact that it's a game that they're not really used to. They don't really know too much about it, and now they do. And they think it's interesting. I don't know. But, you know, again, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Because it really does mean a lot to me. And, you know, eh, there's a glowy pet. Oh, that's Blink Root over there. I wonder if I've seen that yet. I don't think I have. There's a hornet, and I'm not actually looking forward to that. Did I kill it? I don't know. I can't fucking see. Because rip eyesight. See, this is where a grappling hook would come in handy. Ooh, another thing. Yeah. Ooh, this is nice. Ooh, there's a bookshelf. There's a fucking bookshelf, boyos. Get out of here. My bookshelf. Not your bookshelf. Mine. Go away. It's down here. Still not glow stick so I can actually fucking see. Those are that that's that's boom boom. Don't want don't want to boom boom myself. Look at those doors. Those doors are cool. Alright, let's go up and check what's in the chest. More of these spike shoe spikes, so you know, not too I'll just you just take them to sell them. So I can get money, and I'm taking this, because fuck the world, I want something cool in my house. And I actually want to go down up over there, so... Here we go. Oh wait, I see, see that right over there? Statue. And that statue's cool, and I don't care what's... Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh, oh lordy, oh lordy. What have I gotten myself into? There's a random ass statue right here. I want it. Ow. Oh, fuck. Taking it. Oh, there's a lot of shit in here. Holy crap. What did I find? Holy shit. What did I find? I found like the holy grail. 
What is that? Is that a platinum? It's a platinum chandelier. What don't I need in here? That one sand block? No, I don't need that. Silk? Nah. Fine. Nah. Wow, this is Reaper statue. I want that. What's in here? Okay. Oh, yeah. So this is actually something I, I would have wanted. Is this uh, eye, suspicious eyeball? Because summoning the Eye of Cthulhu is actually going to be really good for us to do. Because of the fact that uh, if we summon the Eye of Cthulhu, we are able to, why can't I think right now, uh, get more of the uh, stuff that made this thing re- oh. That made the uh, the thing we have. I don't know why I can't think right now. Don't ask me. Wait, no, I, I want to keep the flare gun because the flare gun's just funny. Oh shit. Wait, jerkins, I don't need those. Oh wait, I don't need those either. Fuck. I'm taking this though. Damn, there's- look at all the shit that's in Ow, ow. Wait, oh. There's probably a bee that I didn't see. Oh yeah, wait, we want that life crystal, so let's go down here. Yeah. Oh shit. Okay, well. Jungle spores we want to keep- Ah! Oh god, what's happening? We, we just fell. It's okay. Don't panic. Hiya. Hiya. Okay, so let's real quick. There. Alright, that was yeah, that was easy. Okay. What's over there? What's that? Holy shit. That's a big ass hornet. Those are two piranha plants from Mario. Go away. You can hit those things through the wall because it'd be kind of unfair if you couldn't hit those things through the wall. Because they can hit you through the wall. Oh, a goblin army. A goblin army. Uh, is there anything important down there that I can't see? I don't know. I don't think so. Alright, we're going home. Peace out. Goblin army, goblin army, goblin army. This is what we needed. This is what we needed. Goblin army. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, go, 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 go. Uh, loot all, store all the money. What goes in here? Chest, put that in there. Put the mahogany chest, put the keg in there, I don't know. Put that in there, put that in there, put that in there. Uh, okay, ice chest. All of the potions that I don't need right now. Potion. Okay, uh, oh yeah, wait, chandelier is going this one because this is building material. Boom, bang. Uh, I think this one is my random chest. Yeah, it is. So that, 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 those. Oh shit. Oh shit. Boys. Boys. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, here they are. They're here. Let's go. There they are. Get them. Get them. Hey. Yeah. Get them. Kill the goblins. There's a lot of them in this pit and I don't want to go in there to fight them. I don't have my Hermes boots on. Shit, I fucked up. I should have my Hermes boots on. Who dodged the magic. Kill them all. Yeah. Shit. Ooh, ha. I got a spiky ball. Kill them. Kill them all. All of the goblins must die. Ow. Oh. Uh, Face me. Face me at your own peril. Yeah. Hey, wa ha ya wa. Don't hit me. Kill them. Kill them all.
And as you guys can see down in the bottom right hand corner, there's a percentage that I have to beat before it's over. So this is a awesome that this happened now. Because this is going to make me able to do a lot more in this game. Oh, screw you, buddy. Just cut them all into pieces. Oh god, there's a lot of them in that hole. Go! Another good thing about Terraria is that the weapons don't actually have uh, derp abilities, so I can I can use this thing all I want for as long as I want. No. Yeah, kill them all. So, I mean, we're doing pretty decent, like time-wise, because this is just gonna take a while. Because I'm the only one here killing them. And I kind of moved away from my house so because the, they can open up doors so the NPCs wouldn't just be ravaged. Get them. Yes, kill them, kill them. Kill them dead. This is fucking amazing. Look at all the dead fucking pieces of goblin around. Screw you guys. I'm here to fight. Think you can invade my land? Don't think so. Motherfuckers. Fuck you. Okay. See, then we have people over there. Oh my. Ha! Hiya! Screw you. 85%, we're almost done. Oh, God. Throw them up this side. Oh, my goodness. Got a harpoon. Screw you, Goblin Sorcerer. Ow. 94%. Come on. 97. 98. 99. And done. They've been defeated. Now we just have to kill the rest of them that are still in existence. And then they'll all be dead. Get back here. You ain't, you ain't retreating. Get back here. You don't invade my land and expect to retreat. So, now we get to a really good part in the game where I have to go find somebody called the Goblin Tinkerer. Now, the Goblin Tinkerer is an NPC that is actually bound underground. So, he doesn't, uh, what's it called? He, yeah, see, look, they break doors. Fucking assholes. So, what he does is he has a special bench that I can use for special crafting. It's pretty much... That is exactly what I'm going to be looking for next episode, but I'm going to put this one off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. I'm loving Terraria. I fought the Goblin Army. That was perfect timing. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what else to say. It was it was cool. So, yet again, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. Leave a like if you are, comment, and subscribe if you want to, if you don't. Alright, cool, cool. It's not, I'm not making it.